Mighty Express, Mighty Trains Race is a short film from 2022. This is directed by William Lowe and written by Dan Denko. And this is the second Mighty Express film that I've seen. And I have to say, I rather enjoyed it. It has a good message about listening to people and being sensible rather than going full steam ahead. And the animation is absolutely gorgeous. This is about Freight Nate. And he ends up participating in this race, this high speed race. And because obviously he wants to win, he starts going at great speed and isn't really paying attention to the warning signs that there are dangers of doing this and that there are potential dangers around him. And the episode is all about him coming up against these dangers, obviously trying to overcome those obstacles. That's the action in the, in the episode or in the film. And then, of course, we have the message that he should have, should have listened and that it's important to stop and pay attention and assess the situation rather than doing something that might get you into a bit of trouble and that might result in injury. Obviously, this is a really important lesson. I think it's an important lesson for anybody of any age. I think we can all do well to to remember that sometimes we need to stop and think before we proceed with something, but also for young children who are maybe more likely to just run straight ahead into something without really assessing the situation. I think that this is a, a really brilliant message. It's very well delivered. Freight Nate is a, a very likable character. It's very easy to listen to the lessons that he is learning and listen to what he is being told. And then, I, as I said before, the animation is so stunning. Obviously, because he is racing, he travels quite a distance and we get a variety of backdrops and a lot of twists and turns on the tracks. And it's just, it's absolutely stunning. It is so beautiful to look at that I found it to be really engaging and really entertaining. And I can absolutely see this being quite captivating for young viewers. And obviously, if it's easy to pay attention to, that means the message is more likely to sink in. So it really has quite a lot to offer. And I think it's brilliant for the target audience, for the target age, but also for us older viewers who are fans of animation with a particular penchant for train-based animations. It's rather delightful as well. I had a lot of fun with it. I thought it was pretty great. And if it sounds like it would appeal to you, then I definitely recommend Mighty Express, Mighty Trains Race.